Tonight, a stolen car is always bad news, but it was even worse for the owner of an SUV after suffering a life-changing injury. New specialist Andrew Adams joins us live. And Andrew, it sounds like it's been a real rough month for this, for this guy you're about to report on. It uh, really has been, and you know, you'll see this in just a little bit, what a tough circumstance has been and just got even worse. I hope that, you know, karma is going to treat him well <laughs> um, after this. The thief came when nobody expected it. We woke up and we noticed that my vehicle was stolen from the driveway. Jared Potter says his SUV was suddenly gone. It's a 2016 Toyota 4Runner Limited. A massive humbug just in time for the holidays. Um, but yeah, I've definitely poured uh, a lot of love into it. A car theft two weeks before Christmas would have been plenty on anybody's plate. It like, just kind of is like, what the heck? Like, who, who, steals, who steals a car from a, from a guy who just got paralyzed? Potter's plate has been full ever since he went paragliding in early October. Unfortunately, I got myself into a position um, that uh, led to me basically getting into an accident. The crash left him horribly injured. That broke my left femur in half, uh, as well as led to a, a spinal cord injury. The current prognosis is that there's, that I'm, that I'm never gonna walk again. The theft of the SUV only makes getting places that much harder. When it rains, it pours, I guess. Like, I don't know what else is gonna come at me. Potter, through it all, has stayed positive. I mean, I'm hopeful, so I have a fairly optimistic outlook on the world. He just hopes with Christmas, now only days away, the thief has a change of heart. Hope that, you know, you can maybe, uh, you know, redeem yourself a little bit. That was Andrew Adams reporting. What a remarkable positive attitude. Potter's hoping that anyone who knows the whereabouts of his forerunner will report it to Sandy Police and will put a plate number along with a link to a GoFundMe to help Potter on our website at ksltv.com.